I was disappointed that um, the governor's address uh, mentions that he wants to cut $400 million out of education funding. He's balancing the budget, which I appreciate him doing that, but he's doing that on the back of education. That is unfair. That hurts every community across the state. The, the funding for state mandated programs that he's also cutting, uh, $246 million, I believe. Again, that's transportation. That's busing kids to school. Um, absolutely unfair and unreasonable. The higher education funding that he's cutting 5% will make a big difference to families who are trying to send their kids to college. State universities have been for many, many years the place where families who were of moderate means knew that they could send their children for quality educations. This, this puts that at risk. Uh, I am glad that the governor mentioned pension reform in his address to us today. We do need that leadership that seems to have been missing from his office. He challenged the legislature today to bring a bill to him. He said that he would sign an executive order if that's what it took um, to fix the pension crisis. So I would ask him to be more forthcoming with his ideas. If he's got an executive order that he would be prepared to sign, I wish he would share that with leadership and with general members so that we know what that is, so that we know what to work towards.